like the speed of sound. We can keep on the ground. What is going on guys, Brethren here and welcome to the first episode of Modded Survival. So let's get going. As you can see here the map is created by Caustic Productions as well as Debo Productions. I did a uh, modded showcase on this. It looked pretty cool and a lot of you wanted to see me actually play it so I thought I'd give it a go. So with that being said, it's kind of like Skyblock guys. Uh, th those little free floating islands up there contain chests and we need to kind of get to them and at the same time we have challenges that we do need to complete and I will have all those in the description so you guys can check those out as well but nevertheless starting out what we need to do is we obviously need to get some sort of tools crafted so let's go ahead and get some wood here and hopefully this tree will drop us a few saplings as well that way we can get a few more of these trees growing as well. Um, I was searching around and I didn't see too much stone. I know that there is a monster spawner up in this direction right uh, there we go. So we can get up there but the only thing about that is that I think it's a skeleton spawner so we have to be very careful about bows and or arrows really knocking us off because if we fall that is uh, that is no good. So anyways, here's our starter chest. As you can see here, we got some birch saplings as well as sugar cane, pumpkin seeds, melon slices, lava, as well as ice. We are playing on hardcore as well, guys. I wanted to mention that. So I don't know what I'm going to do, whether I'm, if I'm going to play, or not hardcore, but we are playing on hard. <laughs> I said hardcore there for a second, which we hopefully are going to be getting into the TU12. Um, but anyways, basically, guys, I'm going to be playing on hard. I don't know if... The way I should do it is let me know in the comment section. If I die, should I just totally quit or should I keep the series going? I was thinking maybe put it on hard and if I die, you know, then I just kind of die and we can try and complete as many challenges as we can before I actually end up dying. Hopefully I won't end up dying though. But let's go ahead and craft this up a crafting table here. Um, let's see here. Let's make some wood and let's go ahead and craft this up a pickaxe. We'll definitely need some of that. And as well, guys, is there is a hidden, um, what is it here? A hidden stronghold in one of these directions here, as well as in the wall there are hidden ores as well. So with that being said, let's go ahead and craft up a pickaxe. I think we already did. Yep, and let's craft up a sword as well, just so we can defend ourselves from oncoming mobs. But we definitely need to get a little bit of the stone here. We definitely need to find some stone, period, so that we can craft up some better swords, as well as I would like to get that iron right there. So, let's see if we can't... Which way is this? Is the mob spawner this way? You know what? Let's go up this way and kind of make a little trail or a little walkway up to the mob spawner, because I would like to stack my way up, but I'm just scared that those skeletons are going to knock me right off. And if that is the case, that would not be good for me. So let's just try this right here and just slow but steady kind of go up here. Hopefully we'll find some stone along the way but I think this is all sandstone if I'm not mistaken and until we get up to the actual mob spawner. So let's get us a few of these. We could stack our way up but hmm, I'm just so worried that I, you know one of those skeletons is going to knock us off so I don't want to try you know anything too crazy but I guess we could maybe 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 try it how far did we go up there I'd say we were hmm, maybe a quarter of the way so maybe it'll be easiest to do this and kinda jump over there we'll try it we'll see how it goes hopefully I won't die I can hear him already look at that oh this is looking sketch this is looking really sketch guys I don't know about this oh I don't know about this Oh, <laughs> like I said, I did not know about that. Oh my goodness. So we already died, so it probably wouldn't be. Yeah, I think I'm definitely going to continue the series, guys. Um, considering we already died, but we do have it on heart. So let's just go ahead. Let's just continue with our original plan. I know it might be tedious and boring, but it seems like that would be the safest way to actually get up to this mob spawner without killing ourselves. So, 
let's just continue to dig here. I wish I had a few torches. Do I not? No, but there is some coal down here. Let me get some coal so you guys can see. Alright, where was the coal at? Over this way. Okay. Get a few of these going. We'll make us some torches. I would like to maybe save a piece or two of this because I don't see any more currently around here without actually digging more into the sandstone. So I'm going to save a piece or two of this just for, say, food or something like that. Um, there goes our pickaxe. That's unfortunate. We'll just save those two pieces there. I'm going to build another pickaxe here. And hello. Is there not? What's going on? Oh, I need another stick okay all right hmm man that is just crazy that's just crazy all right so let's go ahead and put some more torches down where we we didn't even make any torches we'll just craft a few of them up here there we go all right that should suffice there we go and there we go all right so we shouldn't have too far much more too far much more we shouldn't have that long more to dig as I can already hear them yeah they're getting louder and louder so we're right up underneath them right now um hmm maybe start even digging up this way just a little bit alright and there we are right here let's let's take a look at where we're actually at there it is. Okay, so it's not that far off. Let's go ahead and dig up a little bit more here. Hopefully, this does have some stone for us. Or cobblestone. I hope it's not all mossy sandstone. Or not mossy sandstone, but just mossy stone in general. Because I would like to make a few tools. Most definitely. Oh no! Creeper! Oh! Jeez! We are not having good luck right now, guys. Oh my goodness, I've already died twice. Alright, guys, so I finally managed to get up here in the spawner. It took forever. I died a bunch of times. So needless to say, guys, it looks like we will be continuing the series on hardcore. Or on hard, rather. But anyway, with that being said, it is a skeleton spawner, which is pretty cool. We can now get some bones to make bone meal and all that sorts of good stuff, as well as arrows. I do have a few of that in my inventory just from fighting them off and then falling to the ground. Ooh, look, there's some XP down there as well. I should probably go grab that. But, um, yeah, let's see what's up in these chests here. Ooh, wow. Okay, this is definitely what we needed. Some iron as well as a little bit of food and some more iron very nice very nice okay so now we can craft up the much needed pickaxe to where we can start getting some of these ores that we will need to carry on in the game and complete some more of these challenges of course guys like I said I will put those challenges in the description so you guys can check all of those out and I will try and maybe put something on the screen or something when we do complete a challenge so far I don't think we've completed any challenges uh, build a stone generator or a cobblestone generator, okay, yeah. Um, in order to do that, though, we would need... Okay, so we can actually make one. Let's go ahead and actually do that right now. Um, here we go. And we'll place... Let's go ahead and... There we go. And come over here. Alright, so... That should be good. It should be good right here. And let's go ahead and place our lava... And let's go ahead and place our ice block. All right. It should take a second to melt, and we should get some good stuff. Why is this lava just staying in one spot? That's weird. Why do you do this? And let's try and uh, see if that works. Really? There we go. Okay. And there goes our... I think we can just break this. Let's just try and break this, if I'm not mistaken. There we go. Alright. Because I remember there for a little while, if you would to uh, break the ice block on the Xbox, it would actually just disappear. So, I'm glad they actually fixed that. I don't know what title update they actually fixed that in, but it's good to see that they did. Let's just keep getting, keep getting some uh, cobblestone here. And we can make us up a few tools that we might need. I can get some of these challenges done. 
I can probably do a lot of this off screen though as well. Let's go ahead and craft up. Ooh, XP. I totally forgot to get that as well. We'll grab up some of this um, coal as well here. I think I got a few torches, but I would like to make some food. Uh, let's see here. Let's go over to our little crafting table. And let's make up a... Right here. An iron pickaxe as well as an iron sword. There we go. Anyways, though, guys, I think that is pretty much it for episode one. I hope you guys are enjoying the series thus far. There will be more episodes to come your way, so stay tuned for that. I think I'm going to, you know, get us a little bit of cobblestone here off screen just so you guys don't have to see that boringness and all that. But, uh, it, you know, we're off to a decent start. Even though that mob spawner did give us a little bit of trouble, I think we're off to a decent start. And we'll be definitely cracking out these challenges one by one until we get them all complete hopefully so anyways thanks for watching guys make sure to give the video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and i will see your face in episode two peace out guys Train.